Outside pre-trip, day cab, international. Outside of tractor, check under vehicle for leaks or puddles from the engine and transmission area. All lights are securely mounted, not cracked, clean, and proper color. Amber for turn signals, clearance and ID lights. Clear for headlights. Windshield is securely mounted, clean, not cracked, and with no outdated stickers. Wiper arms and blades are securely mounted and not damaged with proper tension against the windshield. Blades are not cracked or frayed. All mirrors and brackets are securely mounted, not damaged, and mirrors are clean. Under hood, passenger side. <laughs> Exhaust system is securely mounted. No leaks, pulls, or excessive soot visible at the joints. Alternator is securely mounted and not damaged. It is belt driven. All electric wires are securely mounted and not damaged. Alternator belt is securely mounted and not damaged, cracked, or frayed. It has the proper tension of no more than three quarters of an inch of play at its center. Water pump is securely mounted and not damaged, cracked, or leaking. It is gear driven. All hoses under the engine compartment are securely mounted not damaged, cracked, frayed, or leaking. Under hood, driver's side. Coolant reservoir is securely mounted and not damaged or leaking. Check that fluid is at proper level. Never open the cap unless the engine is cool. Engine oil check explanation. Oil fill to and dipstick to are securely mounted and not damaged or leaking. Pull dipstick out, wipe clean, reinsert, pull out and check oil level. If below proper level, add oil through fill to. All hoses will be inspected like they were on the passenger side. Air compressor is securely mounted and not damaged, cracked or leaking. It is gear driven. Frame rail and cross members are securely mounted with no cracks and illegal holes or welds. steering system. Power steering pump is securely mounted and not damaged, cracked, or leaking. It is gear driven. Power steering fluid reservoir is securely mounted and not damaged or leaking. Fluid is at proper level. Steering gearbox is securely mounted and not damaged or leaking. Power steering hoses are all securely mounted and not cracked, frayed, or leaking. The steering linkage, which consists of the steering shaft, pitman arm, drag link, and tie rod, are all securely mounted, not worn, cracked, or loose. They are not missing any nuts, bolts, or cotter keys. Steer axle suspension. Front and rear spring mounts are securely mounted and not damaged or cracked. Spring leaves are securely mounted and not cracked, shifted, or missing. U-bolts are securely mounted to the axle and not damaged or cracked. Shock absorber is securely mounted and not damaged or leaking.
braking system, drum type. Brake hoses are securely mounted and not cracked, frayed, or leaking. Brake chamber is securely mounted and not damaged, cracked, or leaking. Push rod is securely mounted and not damaged, and there should be no more than one inch of play when brakes are released. Slack adjuster is securely mounted and not damaged or worn. No loose or missing clevis pins or cotter keys. Push rod and slack adjuster should make a 90 degree angle when brakes are applied. Brake lining is securely mounted and not cracked or worn dangerously thin. Brake drum is securely mounted and not cracked and free of oil. Steer tire and wheel. I see the inspection inflation condition and depth inflation check with pressure gauge for proper inflation of about 100 psi condition inner and outer side walls have no cuts bulges or divots tread is worn evenly and cannot be recapped depth Tread depth is at least 4 30 seconds of an inch. Valve stem and cap are securely mounted and not damaged or leaking. Rim is securely mounted and not damaged or cracked. There can be no weld repairs. Lug nuts are securely mounted, all present and without rust trails that could indicate looseness. Hub oil seal is securely mounted and not damaged or leaking. Fluid is at proper level. Side of tractor. Door and hinges are securely mounted and not damaged or loose. Door should open and close properly. Turn signal light is securely mounted and not cracked. It is clean and amber in color. Fuel tank and cap are securely mounted and not damaged, cracked, or leaking. DEF tank and cap are securely mounted and not damaged, cracked, or leaking. Steps and catwalk are securely mounted and not damaged and free of debris. Drive shaft and U joints are securely mounted and not cracked or bent and free of debris. The tractor frame will be inspected like it was up front. Electric line is properly inserted into the back of the cab and not cracked or free. The blue service line and the red emergency ear lines are secure, securely mounted to the back of the cab and not cracked, frayed, or leaking. All ear and electric lines are not tangled, kinked, or dragging against the catwalk. Front of trailer. Service and emergency airlines are properly coupled with the glad hands on the front of the trailer and are not leaking. Electrical line is properly inserted into the front of the trailer. Header board is securely mounted with no cracks, bulges, or holes and is able to hold the load. Clearance lights on top of trailer are securely mounted, not cracked or missing. They are clean and amber in color. Fifth wheel. The mounting bolts are all securely mounted and not missing. The platform is securely mounted to the tractor frame and not damaged or cracked. The skid plate is securely mounted to the platform and not damaged or cracked. It isn't missing any pins and is properly lubricated. There's no gap between the skid plate and apron. The apron is securely mounted to the bottom of the trailer and is not damaged or cracked. The kingpin is securely mounted to the apron and is not bent. Locking jaws are securely enclosed around the kingpin. Release arm is securely mounted 
not damaged, and in the fully engaged position. The fifth wheel is positioned properly to the back of the tractor to clear the landing gear during turns. Drive axle. Suspension. Front and rear spring mounts, spring leaves, U-bolts, and shock absorber will be inspected the same as the steer axle. Ear bag mount is securely mounted and not damaged or missing any bolts. Ear bag is securely mounted and not cracked, frayed, or leaking. Brakes, drum type. Brake hoses, brake chamber, push rod, slack adjuster, brake lighting, and brake drum will all be inspected the same as the steer axle. Tires and wheels. Drive tires will be inspected the same as the steer axle with these exceptions. The drive tires can be radial or bias ply but never mismatched on the same axle. The drive tires can be recapped. And the tread depth is at least 230 seconds of an inch. Tire spacing is free of debris and tires are not rubbing. Rims and lug nuts will be inspected the same as the steer axle. The hub axle seal is securely mounted and not damaged, cracked, or leaking. The splash guard is securely mounted and not damaged. The tail lights are securely mounted and not cracked. They are clean and red in color. The reverse light is clear. The DOT reflectors are securely mounted clean in the proper color. Side and bottom of trailer. Landing gear is fully raised. Support frame and landing pads are securely mounted and not damaged or missing any parts. The crank handle is securely stowed. The side panels of the trailer are securely mounted with no cracks, bulges, or holes and are able to hold the load. The long members, cross members, and floorboards are securely mounted and not damaged or cracked and are able to support the load. All lights are securely mounted, not cracked and clean in the proper color. Amber on the side and red in the rear. The DOT reflectors are securely mounted and clean in the proper color. The tandem release arm and pins are securely mounted, not damaged, and are in the fully engaged position. The door tie back is securely mounted and not damaged or missing. Trailer axle. Suspension. The torque rod is securely mounted and not damaged or cracked. Brake hoses. Brake. Brake hoses, brake chamber, push rod, slack adjuster, brake lining, brake drum will be inspected the same as on the steer axle. The airbag mounts, the airbags, and the shock absorbers will be inspected the same as on the drive axle. Tires and wheels. Tires, tire spacing, rims, lug nuts, and splash guard will be inspected the same as on the drive axle. The hub oil seal will be inspected the same as on the steer axle. Rear of trailer. Door panels, hinges, and latches are all securely mounted and not damaged, 
cracked or missing any parts. The door should open, close, and latch securely. Door tie backs are securely mounted and not damaged or missing. All lights, including clearance, ID, brake, and turn signal, are securely mounted, not cracked, and clean, and red in color. And the ABS light is amber. The DOT reflectors are securely mounted and clean and the proper color. That concludes the outside pre-trip. When you do your outside pre-trip, please, you need to go in the rear. Lean down and check and see what you have. This particular trailer has airbag mounts, airbag and the shock absorber. Please, you gotta expect that. If you don't see that, you might have front and rear spring mounts, spring leaves, U-bolt, etc. Look down, see what you are inspecting, what the trailer has. The same goes with the engine compartment. See what side the coolant reservoir is on. The water pump could be on the passenger side or the driver's side. Always check and see what you have. Have a good pre-trip.